India's Pak FA will be superior to the Russian T50 in Chinese J20, Chinese media. Highlights Russian Pak FA T50 cost over $100 million apiece. Indian Pak FA will be superior in stealth, supercross, advanced sensors, networking, and combat avionics. India plans to build as many as 127 stealth fighters. India's new fifth-generation stealth fighter will be superior in key aspects to Russia's Pak F-8050 from which it's derived, and will also have the added advantage of being able to fire the newest iteration of the fearsome Brahmas cruise missile, the Brahmas NG. And as a Pak FA is already superior to China's Chengdu J-20 low observable fighter, this means the Indian stealth jet will also be superior to the J-20. Indian media reports said India's as yet unnamed stealth fighter will include a total of 43 improvements over the Pak F-8050, making it superior in many key aspects to the Russian fighter, of which only 6 have been produced, because they cost over $100 million apiece. That's far too expensive for a battered Russian economy still crippled by Western sanctions triggered by Russia's illegal annexation of the Crimea in 2014. The Indian stealth fighter will be superior in stealth, supercross, advanced sensors, networking and combat avionics to Pak FA. Under a co-development deal, India will develop one prototype, while Russia will develop another. The Indian version will be at a seat fighter manned by a pilot and a weapon systems operator. The Russian version will be a traditional single-seat stealth fighter like the Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II. India wants its indigenous stealth fighter jet to become operational with the Indian Air Force before 2025. It plans to build as many as 127 stealth fighters. <music> India's fifth generation fighter aircraft, FGFA, project will be developed and produced by the Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL, at its facility in Nashik at an estimated cost of $25 billion. The agreement has been completed on our end, we are ready to sign it. It is now down to the Indian side. There are some formalities to figure out, but I think it will be signed by the end of this year," said Sergei Kemazov, CEO of Russian weapons maker Ostech Corporation. Kemzov noted the project will produce a state-of-the-art fighter jet, and it will be the result of the work on Russia's most modern technology done by both Russian and Indian engineers. As fifth generation, it means fifth generation speed, ballistics and military equipment, avionics and stealth capabilities among other qualities. A significant advantage to the Indian stealth fighter will be its ability to loft and launch Brahmas NG, next generation, a lighter, smaller but deadlier version of the original Brahmas built to destroy enemy warships. Also called Mini Brahmas, this new version will be 50% lighter than the original version but will be just as fast at Mach 3.5, 4300 km slash H. Expected to become operational after 2018, 
Bram SNG will have a far smaller radar cross-section or RCS than its predecessor, making it far more difficult to locate and destroy. Brahma NG will arm the Indian Air Force's Sukhoi Su-30 MKIA Superiority Fighter, McCoy and MiG-29K carrier-based multi-role fighter, HAL Tejas Light Attack Fighter for land and carrier use, and the Dazzled Raphael multi-role fighter, of which 36 have been purchased by India. The Su-30 MKI will be able to carry three Brahmus NGs, while the other combat aircraft will carry one each. It's not known how many Brahmus NGs India's new stealth fighter will carry. Please, like, comment, share, and, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Please check out my other videos.